Three years, nine months, and 15 days ago, all 335 of us started high school. Shocking, isn't it? August 25th, 2008 marked the beginning of a four-year ritual. Our English teachers call this ritual the rites of passage. Our science teachers name it puberty, while, we, as, while us students simply call it high school. It was four years of learning and fun, and it has been four years of exciting new experiences. For some of us, it was the first homecoming dance, the first job, or even the first time behind the wheel of a car. A great deal has happened in these short four years we spent with each other. The years have flown by, leaving behind loving memories of high school. During the past four years, we have changed. We become smarter, more sociable, and more aware of what the future holds for each of us. Now, we are at a great turning point in our lives. We are no longer boys and girls, rather, we are men and women. Now, we will be on our own. We will be tested as to whether we can survive life without our families and high school friends. With all the success we've obtained, we owe many thanks to those who have inspired and assisted us. On behalf of the senior class, I would like to thank our teachers for guiding and preparing us to be leaders of the 21st century. I'd like to thank the history department for showing us that teachers still care about teaching, the math teachers who taught us when we don't like the problem in front of us, just rewrite it, the science teachers who stress the importance of passion in teaching, the English department for never capping our creativity, and lastly, the extracurricular sponsors who pass down everything they know about leadership. Thank you to the whole senior class for making the last four years exciting and interesting. Most importantly, I would like to thank all the parents for encouraging and guiding us. Without them, we would not be where we are today. Lastly, I urge you all to come to the class reunion. I want to see you all again. I will miss you all. I will miss Edison and its classic black and gold decor. The class of 2012 is one of the best, brightest, most spirited, and most athletic classes that has ever graduated from medicine. I commend you all for a job well done. I would like to remind you that today is not an end, today is not a beginning. Today is merely the end of the beginning. Once again, congratulations to the class of 2012.